Hello everyone, welcome back to our Code Shop channel. Today we are diving into something super useful for business owners and managers. How to effectively manage employee expenses with Odo 17. If you ever struggled with tracking, approving or reimbursing employee expenses, this video is for you. So let's get started. Let me tell you about the typical workflow. If you are going on a business trip and have many receipts, the easiest way is to take pictures of your receipts and upload them either individually or all at once through the mobile application. Each uploaded receipt will automatically generate a new expense entry. You can then group all these expenses into an expense report to submit to a manager for approval. You can assign these improvers in the employee profile. So inside the employees module, if I click on my employee and go to work information tab, we can set the expense improver here. Okay, let's go back to our expense module. I don't currently have any expenses, so let's create a new one. Here we can try a sample receipt. Just choose one of these examples. Let it be the last one. So once you select it, it will create a new expense. If you want to create your own new expense, simply click on the new button. Now from here, enter the brief description of the expense. Next, select the appropriate category from the drop-down menu. All these categories are created in our system and we can configure them as we need. As we can see, we can set the accounting settings and we can actually re-invoice a customer for expenses. The list of these categories can be found in configuration, expense categories. Okay, let's go back creating our expense. Now enter the total amount of the expense and here we can apply taxes. Select the name of the employee who is claiming the expense and specify who paid for the expense. If the employee paid out of pocket, so we need to reimburse the employee. If the company paid directly, select company. Then we can specify the date of the expense and choose which journal we want to expense through. At the top left we have several buttons. So we can create report, attach receipt, split expense or digitize document. Here you can see the status of the current expense. Ok, now let's create a report. The next step is to submit it to the manager. The manager will receive a notification to approve this. As I select myself as a manager, I can do it right now. Once it is approved, we need to post these journal entries. And since this was paid by the employee, we need to create an invoice to pay our employees through payroll, or we will just create a vendor invoice. So let's post these journal entries. That's going to create an expense within accounting, and we can see it in our vendor bills. Now from here, we need to register the payment. Select the journal, the payment method, and create a payment. So this is how Odo manages employee expenses. I hope everything was clear. Thank you for watching.